Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are doing a summon on the part one of the Fates crossover in Grand Summoners. It has been a while since we did a summoning video. I'm not gonna be doing a crazy summoning video like a thousand dollars on a banner or something like that. I'm just gonna be doing a normal summon because the, the characters are not that great the, and they are not really the characters I want to get. The, the characters I only want from this crossover is only Emia, no one else. But yeah, let's get right into it. Okay. Okay, we have button the ten dollar packs as well so we got these two equips from it i have not done the exchange rainbow gems but let me know in the comments down below which equip or this crossover is um best uh the double girls um uh, the together or the uh, magic one i don't know about that one so oh my god there's a lot of rainbow gems rewards in this mission right here that is crazy okay so we have to be getting that one we have to get this one get this one no, not that one. Uh, get this one. These are the most important ones. The other ones I think is clearing, but multiple times back to back. Okay, yep. So let's go to the summons. For these summons, any anyone we get, I'm happy with it. It doesn't matter who it is, whoever we get is really fine by me. So let's do our free summons right here, right now. Get that out of the way. Okay, and get this one. Let's see what we get. All right, now uh, we got the tickets. So let's do the tickets first in order to. Oh, yeah, by the way, they have updated the summoning banner thingy it shows the characters animation and stuff like that which i really like it looks really really good uh so let's see who, who we can get i'm mostly if i want to get someone from this it's probably maybe these two looks cooler i don't know anything about their kits so i haven't read anything about their kits um i most likely will be trying to do a showcase of these if i can get them if not i'm gonna be getting help from one of the uh, people from the subscribers you know what i'm saying but uh yeah let's see if we can get anyone from the tickets we got a decent loading scene right Did, you, did we just get an actual banner equip? No, another banner. Uh, banner, banner yeah, unit. There's no way. <laughs> That's just stupid. This is so stupid. Okay, let's see. Who are we gonna get? Who is it? Wow. <laughs> Rin <laughs> and Lovia. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. This is so stupid. <laughs> 
<laughs> and we got another one from there as well so let's look at take a look at the wow there's not many equips is there so we got this one which is fire damage magic increase magic by 50 percent for 10 seconds increase art cage by 30 an additional 50 for the first time used wow that is that is a lot uh so you're pretty much wow with the ct of 45 seconds that's 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 pretty decent right there not gonna lie we haven't got this one it says increase all allies art gauge by 20 if the user is human unit reduce all allies damage taken by 15 percent for 15 seconds which is eh okay i guess oh it's a four so that's why all right this one is light damage magic reduce enemies light resistance by 40 percent for 10 seconds if users human unit 20 percent more so if you use it on a human you can get it up to 60 percent for 10 seconds and the ct of this equipment is 50 seconds which is which is decent and i haven't seen this one it's a five star physical uh light damage physical increase attack by 80% for 10 seconds if the user is light unit 50% more wow wow <laughs> that is a that is a really nice buff and this is what i got two times auto fields all allies by, by four for 10 seconds which is 40 that is nuts increase human crit rate 100% for 10 seconds that wow i think this is this is the highlight of the whole thing this and this the others look um let me see this is this is decent as well i think i pretty much got the mvps of these equips so i don't really think i should summon but if you guys think i should summon on this to get any other equips the only equips i'm missing is this one right here and this one i haven't oh I, and this one i haven't gotten anything else but if you guys think i should do a summon on that let me know in the comments down below so in the next video for the next summon we can do that summon right there but uh, we still i think have a good amount of alk saved up as well yeah we have saved up a, a good amount of alk right here no, haven't been farming that much but it's a decent amount that we can use later on in the hopefully we're not forced to use it hopefully you guys enjoy i'll talk to you guys in the next one i actually forgot to show you guys i bought the ten dollar pack so i'm actually getting this um thingy art animation as well right here so i'm gonna be putting this on my character it looks pretty nice if you get the other one there's gonna be a different one as well and we have some ability tab and the sp art ability as well right here which is really really cool i haven't got this one but this on locks after you super awoken the unit and this is the one that you get for paying ten dollars so i bought the other ten dollars as well so if i had gotten the other character i would have gotten the animation for her as well but it is fine it is what it is we didn't get it i am fine with that 100 <laughs> percent because at the end of this uh whole crossover there's gonna be a loop where every one of them are gonna be available for everyone or they're just gonna make it like overload for each character there's gonna be a specific day that you can summon on trying to get that specific unit and if everything goes well i can summon on that one but yeah i'll talk to you guys in the next one